guys, it's Trish. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is my last video for 2022. Today's video, I'm going to show you guys all of my Dior purchases of 2022. If you guys are new to my channel, subscribe and follow me on Instagram. Before I do start today's video, I want to let you guys know that I have a Patreon. Patreon is a monthly subscription that you guys can cancel anytime you want. I have a lot of different kind of tiers, but my main tier for this channel is called C Dior-holics. On there, I share Dior Beauty gift codes, information on the Dior Beauty Loyalty program, um, early access to my IG photos, early access to my YouTube videos, Diptyque gift codes and just a lot of different kind of perks. I'll link my Patreon down below. I also have a Like to Know It, a TikTok, and a TristTrin.com blogs. On my blog, I post like beauty information, holiday packaging, giveaways, um, gift codes, just a lot of different kind of information. So I'll be so happy if you guys do check out my TristTrin.com blogs. So today, I'm going to show you guys all of my Dior purchases of 2022. I'm actually pretty surprised because I feel like some of these items I got last year, but I guess I got it this year. So yeah, I'm very, very shocked at some of the pieces, but let's just get started. So let's start off with January. In January, the first item I purchased is going to be a gold Dior tray. And it's this one here. I got it for my birthday, and this is the um, Stella Around the World motif. This is last year's motif. And it's just a Dior trinket tray. It has the star, it says CD, and in the back it says Dior, made in France. And I put my perfume on these kind of trays. So I really love that. I'm trying to go fast because I have a lot of items. The next item is going to be a navy blue uh, Dior mitzvah scarf. So this one is in navy blue. It's going to be stars. I wanted to get this one because I love the star shape. And it's Dior and it's stars, so I had to get it. So, and it's blue. My favorite color is blue, so I got that Mitsu scarf. The next item is going to be a bucket hat. So, I got this Dior bucket hat in gold, and it's oblique. And this is actually the last size I had available. My essay had to order it for me from a different boutique. And yeah, I really, really love it. So, in the front, it says Christian Dior Paris. It is in gold, it's white, and in oblique. So yeah, I'm really, really obsessed with Dior bucket hats. Um, the next item is going to be my Lady Dior D-Joy handbag. It is limited edition for the Lunar New Year collection. And I'm obsessed. I love it so much. It's butterflies. I had the matching Mitsu scarf. Lady D-Joy handbag is so cute. And I really love the Lady Dior um, like handbag. So I had to get a D-Joy, my first ever of this kind of style. Next, I got a uh, Dior bracelet with my best friend, Madame MM Style Icon. Um, I went to California, and we got the matching Ja Dior bracelet. I have this style. She has the other one. It's in cornflower blue, and she is my best friend, and we get two each year. So this was the first one in January. And then the next purchase I have is the Canage Dior tray. This one I purchased in Beverly Hills Dior and if you guys saw my unboxing video, I had a bad experience. Um, I will not be shopping at Beverly Hills ever again. And just like the atmosphere there, it wasn't very welcoming and it just felt really weird. I didn't really like it. Also, um, the essay wasn't very, very nice and when she packaged my my um, tray, she said they ran out of boxes and she like wrapped it in like a cardboard box with tissue paper or I don't know, I kind of forgot, but it just wasn't a nice presentation. So that was unfortunate, but I still ended up getting a trinket tray because I didn't want something from that California trip that we went on. Next item is going to be the Star Notebook. I also purchased this at Beverly Hills. Bad experience, but I really do love this notebook. Dior Star. Dior Vibe notebook. And then I also got, um, I ordered this from my essay, Nadia, and she ordered it online for me. So I got Dior color pencils, and I also purchased a Trois de Gris pencil pot. So we have a lot of Dior pencil, uh, color pencils. And I got this gray Trois de Gris pencil pot, which I love so, so much. It is really, really cute. And then uh, that is it for January. Next is February. February, I got the Dior Vibe water bottle, which is this one here. I love Dior water bottles. 
Christian Dior Dior Vibe, which has the star, Dior Vibe water bottle. And then I also got, oh, that's it from February. Then March, I got the Cupidon collection. I got the Mitzah scarf, the mug, notebook. So here is the notebook, and then here is the mug. And unfortunately, my ex said she had to order it from Beverly Hills. And again, when it came, they put it in a cardboard box, like just a regular shipping box. But then they just stuffed it inside a white Dior shopping bag. No boxes, no tissue paper. It was just really, really bad. So Beverly Hills presentation is awful, but my essay Nadia is the best. So she was able to order it from me. I got the Cupid, Cupid on mug and also the notebook. Like I said, I got the Mitzah scarf too, but it's on my other handbag right now. But it's basically the same design, but in a Mitzah scarf. And then, let's see, what else did I get? I got the red oblique Mitzah scarf, which is so beautiful. If you guys know me, you guys know that I love Dior oblique. And I love collecting the oblique Mitzah scarf in all the colors. I have like navy blue, I have gray, I have rose devance, um, and the red. I think that's... All I have. I can't. Oh, and burgundy. And then let's see. In March, I also got my Rose de Vance necklace, which I've been wearing so so many times in yellow gold, diamond, and a mother of pearl. So it's basically like this like star logo. There's a diamond in the middle, mother of pearl, and then in the back is mother of pearl, and it's a yellow gold necklace. And then I also got this jacket that I'm wearing right now. I love this Dior jacket. It is a macro canage. It is in white. And we got like the canage um, design here, which everybody knows is Dior. And I really love it. It's really, really comfortable. It is shorter sleeve, but it's really, really warm. I love it so much. Then I also got the Dior bikini. So I had the top and the bottom. And I love that it comes in these like cute little dust bags. So I got the Dior Vibe bikini. And... This one is going to be the, is this the bottom or the top? Okay, so this is going to be the bottoms. And then this is going to be the top of the bikini. Right here. Something like that. But yeah, it's going to be stars. It's the Dior Vibe collection. And I just love it so much. It's really, really nice. And I can't wait to wear it on vacation next year. Uh, let's see what else. Now it is time for May. In May, I got star, star sneakers. I don't have it with me. They're on my closet right now. I just didn't want to like grab any of the shoes since they are already worn and I don't want to put them on my bed. So I got white Dior star sneakers. They're very comfortable. I prefer them over the walking Dior sneakers because they're really beautiful and really comfortable. So I do recommend these star sneakers. Then in June, I got the Dior D-Way slides in the Union motif. Again, another shoe, um, but it's brown in the Union motif, which I love so much. And then in July, I got the Dior Riviera water bottles. So I have an orange one and a blue one in Trois de Jouy, just Dior water bottles. But again, I really do love collecting like Dior water bottles. I have an orange one and a blue one. Very, very nice and very beautiful. And I've actually have used them already. It's not just a collection. I do actually use the water bottles. Um, I went hiking and they keep your water long for, for long. Um, 24 hours cold and 12 hours hot. So yeah, that is really, really nice. And then I also got the Baby Dior dress. So I got this cute short sleeve um, blue oblique baby Dior dress. I got this because it fits me and it's really comfortable. I love it a lot. The material is like velvety. It's really pretty and I think I got like a size, I got 12 plus so that fits me. I'm around a size 36 women's if that helps anybody wanting to get baby Dior. Um, and then let's see, in August I got a Dior bra. So I got a Dior Vibe bra and it comes in this cute dust bag and then or like a drawstring bag and then here is the bra that I purchased, Dior Vibe bra. So this is how it looks, Dior Vibe bra and I think it's in like technical fabric or something. In the back it says Christian Dior Active 2021 Extra Performance Ready to Vibe because it is Dior Vibe collection. 
and I really really love it. It's really comfortable and I'm going to use it for like um, vacation, traveling and also working out since it is like a sports bra. So I love it a lot. And then I also got a another Dior, ba baby Dior dress. I'm saving this dress for my birthday. So it's a baby Dior houndstooth dress. And it's really cute. It is very stretchy at the stomach. So I would wear like a belt right here. And it says there's like a little Dior tag right here. It's super cute. And it's like velvety as well, which I love so much. And yeah, I'm saving it for my birthday, which I'll be wearing in January. I'm super, super excited. And then next I have the medium Lady Dior. It is limited edition. I have it laying down here. So the charm is a bit messed up right now. But basically, this is a limited edition medium, did I say mini? It's a medium Lady Dior in the uh, winter garden motif. So there's like floral trees, nature, birds, and it's really, really stunning. I do have the matching Mita scarf, but it's in the handbag right now. I just need my essay to retie it for me because she just wraps it really, really nicely. So yeah, I got the medium Lady Dior. And then uh, next I got... Oh! The Dior Riviera Straws. So it's just a orange um, packaging. But in here we have Dior Bamboo Straws. And there's also a like little straw cleaner as well. Make sure you guys can see this. So we have some like Christian Dior Bamboo Straws. And then I also got the new Dior Lady Dior um, Zipped Key Case. And it has a charm right here. It's like a little hook for your keys or whatever you want to attach it on. And it's a zipped card holder in canage. And it is in the color hazelnut. I really, really love this. Um, you can put like your coins in here, your card, your cash. Um, you can fit like a lot of things in here. It's really, really nice. And I think in August, I don't have it written down, but I'm pretty sure in August I got this bracelet as well. This is the Rose Devon's bracelet. It is the same as my necklace. It is in yellow gold, mother pearl, and diamond. It has the Mimi Rose right here. And it's super cute. It just fits on just like the Justin Clue. You just kind of like twist it a little bit and then it slides on. So yeah, I'm just going to wear it for the rest of this video. But it's really, really nice. And I love the Rose Devon's collection so, so much. Next is going to be October. And I forgot to grab it. But I just have too many things on my bed right now. I don't want to like drop anything. But I basically basically got a Baby Dior phone holder. So it has like a crossbody strap. And it's in Trois de Jouis. It's blue and it's a phone holder. I bought it because I went to Knott's Berry Farm, not Scary Farm for Halloween. And they had like a bag policy. Like a mini Lady Dior was too big of a bag to bring. And a phone holder was just the best size. So I wanted something to hold my phone. So yeah, I got a Baby Dior phone holder. And then in November, I got another Jadior bracelet. It is in the Misa print. It's going to be beige. So she has like the animal print. And then I just have the beige one, which I prefer because I didn't really like the animal print as much. So I have the beige one, which says Christian Dior. Another, brace, another friendship bracelet. And then I also got... Um, oh, that's it for November. But in December, I purchased... A Dior notebook, which again, I forgot to grab, but it's basically like this one, but it's going to be the design behind me. It's this year's holiday packaging. So I got that, and I also got a Dior Cruise t-shirt, basically that notebook design, and it has a ship on there. This motif is created by Pietro Rufo, and then I also got a Dior washcloth, basically kind of like a face towel in canage. It is very, very beautiful. And then I got three Dior shoes. Again, I don't want to show it, but I got the Dior Natalie D boots, Dior D Grace ballet pumps, and the Dior D Way uh, D Way heeled slides that has like the like metallic threading and like the cute like crystal gemstones on there. But that is going to be all of my Dior purchases in 2022. Uh, let me know which is your favorite purchase uh, from me. Um, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, follow me on Instagram, check out my Patreon, like to know what TikTok and Insta uh, TikTok and Trisha.com blogs, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!